So now let's do the cleansing of your pendulum. So when you get a pendulum or really any stone um, that you're gonna do any work with, you should cleanse it because it does hold on to any negative energy. Uh, so the way to do that, there is um, a fine mesh net of light and love and I'm saying it like that because I haven't really said any of these things to people, um, aside from the fact that it's just something that I've learned how to do and I do it, but I haven't really told everybody about some of these things. And I know people are gonna think it's nuts, but it really works. And I fully believe this. My dog too, see, listen to her. Beatrice is like full on. <laughs> she says, bring me that fine mesh net of light and love. Um, I must be getting a delivery, but we're gonna just continue on. Yeah, there we go. And she's gonna slow down. Yes, I know you believe in this. She's like, just cleanse me right now, maybe. Um, you're later, Beatrice. So <laughs> the way to do this is you're gonna visualize a fine mesh net. And I picture it like, it's however you wanna visualize in your own mind, but I picture it as like a fine cheesecloth and you're going to visualize, see this is like really vibrating right now. You're going to visualize, close your eyes in your meditative state and visualize the mesh net cleansing and going through this pendulum and collecting anything detrimental, anything negative, and you can't, there's many different things that you can say, um, but I just say, please, um, cleanse this uh, pendulum it is in this situation please cleanse this pendulum of any detrimental energies and remove them and send them off into the universe so they're not detrimental to anyone else you just visualize basically like a really tight weave cloth going through here going through your pendulum coming off and just dispersing off and the main thing too is always net something that when you're clearing anything detrimental or anything negative that it goes off and does not give anyone else any detrimental energies and does not go to anybody else it's very important that it is dispersed so that it has no negative impact on anyone else it's very important so it's just a lot of visualization a lot of really opening your mind to a lot of different things and understanding that there's so much out there that we don't know about but you really just have to believe and and you will see proof, you will see so many things happening that you, you wouldn't ever believe were possible. But this is just a simple thing. Cleanse your pendulum before you start working so nothing is attached to it and then start dousing. <laughs> 